Hi a very good day, today I am going to talk about ongoing research and groundbreaking development in the realm of sustainable energy. Nobel laureate to build rapid-fire laser-powered nuclear fusion reactor by 2030. Shuji Nakamura, a Nobel Prize awardee in the field of physics, is the latest entrant in the energy domain looking to generate power using nuclear fusion. Nakamura, a professor at the University of California, Santa Barbara, founded his company Blue Laser Fusion in November 2022, and aims to build a nuclear fusion reactor by 2030, Nikkei Asia reported. Nuclear fusion technology aims to replicate the process occurring on the sun to generate vast amounts of energy in a controlled manner. Unlike nuclear fission, fusion does not produce radioactive waste, making it a promising energy source not only for Earth but also for space missions. To initiate fusion ignition, researchers must heat the fuel to over a million degrees Celsius, a feat they have accomplished using various methods. However, the main challenges lie in sustaining the reaction and producing more energy than is consumed during the fusion process. Two approaches to sustain nuclear fusion. Nuclear scientists have used two major approaches in their attempts to sustain a fusion reaction. One involves the use of magnetic confinement where the fuel in its plasma state is held in a torus or donut shape by powerful magnets. The approach has led to the development of tokamak reactors and has seen a lot of involvement from companies and venture capital in their quest to sustain a fusion reaction. The other is to use lasers and fire them in rapid succession. The drawback of the approach, however, is that large equipment is unable to fire lasers in continuous mode whereas small equipment cannot generate outputs high enough to ignite fusion fuel. This is where Blue Laser Fusion thinks, it can make a difference. Nuclear Fusion Powered by Lasers Nakamura, who was awarded the Nobel Prize for his pioneering work on the development of blue light emitting diodes, LEDs, believes that his company can harness their semiconductor expertise to create a secure pathway for achieving nuclear fusion and transforming it into a commercially viable venture. The precise details of the approach remain undisclosed as Blue Laser Fusion currently has a pending patent. However, Nakamura is confident in the feasibility of constructing rapid-fire lasers and envisions the establishment of a 1 gigawatt generating reactor in either Japan or the US by the end of the decade. Prior to that milestone, the company intends to construct a small-scale experimental plant in Japan before the conclusion of the next year, as reported by Nikkei. In the few months since its inception, Blue Laser Fusion has filed more than a dozen patent applications in the US and other countries. The company is also looking at boron instead of deuterium as a fuel for its fusion reactors. As per the company's claims, boron, when used as a fuel, does not produce harmful neutrons, making it a more favorable choice. Blue Laser Fusion is also teaming up with other Japanese companies such as Toshiba Energy Systems and Solutions, a maker of turbines for nuclear power plants, and Tokyo-based Yuki Holdings, which provides metal processing services. In December 2022, the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory in the U.S. successfully demonstrated the use of lasers for generating more energy from a nuclear fusion process. Nonetheless, the accomplishment was only momentary, and for blue laser fusion to become commercially viable, they must demonstrate sustained capabilities over extended periods. The physics of laser-driven fusion is so complex and multifaceted that computer simulations of it often take more time than actual experiments. Early on, modelers were more often learning from the experiments rather than telling the experimenters what to do next. An increasing closeness between model prediction and experimental outcome has underpinned the recent success at NIF and bodes well for future improvements in target design. In the next few months, modelers and experimenters will need to show that the result can be reproduced, achieved again, something that has proven difficult in the past. Blue Laser Fusion, a California-based laser fusion technology company, raised $25 million in initial seed funding. Backers included Jafco Group Company, Limited, and Sparks Group Company, Limited, Mirai Creation Fund 3. The company intends to use the funds to expand research and development operations in the Santa Barbara area and Tokyo to develop its prototype commercial reactor. 
Founded in 2022 by Shuji Nakamura, President and CEO, Blue Laser Fusion is a technology company with new laser fusion technology that aims to accelerate the transition to a carbon-free electrified world using proprietary HB11 fuel. With over 200 claims and patent applications, BLF's laser technology enables mega-joule pulse energy laser with a fast repetition rate to achieve commercial fusion. The company plans to complete its first prototype in 2025, and then demonstrate a commercial-ready fusion reactor by 2030. The technology creates a complete clean energy system to supply electric power to homes, businesses and electric vehicles. Shuji Nakamura has achieved a groundbreaking milestone in the field of nuclear fusion by developing a revolutionary laser-powered reactor. The compact design promises a significant leap towards sustainable energy solutions, harnessing the immense power of nuclear fusion. With this breakthrough, Nakamura has opened up new possibilities for clean and abundant energy generation, bringing us closer to a greener and more sustainable future. I hope you liked the article, thanks for watching, please watch, subscribe and comments, stay connected for more.